Howdy folks. It feels like Houston has been preparing for the Super Bowl forever. I am checking out the uh, fan event at Discovery Green, which apparently takes up 13 football fields worth of space. Uh, it's still eight days out, so it's not that crazy right now because I think it's pretty much all locals. So once the out-of-town folks get in here, it's gonna be nuts. Probably pretty energy intensive because it's literally 60 degrees right now. Trucks on a wall. Here's the Fox broadcast booth. And another one. CNN. NFL Network. They already struggle with the grass here at Discovery Green and it's going to take the whole summer to recover after this. They spent the last year and a half, two years, Totally renovating the George R. Brown Convention Center. I like the pedestrian space out in front. I'm glad it's finally done, and hopefully this will pay off in the future. We put up extra cones in case people don't know not to drive into the train. NASA's here with a virtual reality flight to Mars. Right now the wait's about an hour and a half for like a 30 second ride, but it actually does look pretty cool. Here's a Verizon store, which absolutely did not exist two weeks ago. This is another section all about Houston, or rather the largest companies in Houston. So if you come here, uh, you will get the not totally incorrect understanding that Houston is about oil and gas, oil and gas, oil and gas, and also we have a medical center. And here's this whole other section where they took over all the parking lots in front of Toyota Center and it looks like they're gonna have all the big concerts here. I don't know if you can see the marquee is all the way back there. That's where the Discovery Green part is. So I could believe 13 football fields. It's a big event and they're clearly expecting a lot more people than they have right now. Next weekend is gonna be crazy. Driving in downtown with all the roads that are blocked is gonna get stupid. And parking is like 30 or 40 bucks. I recommend taking public transit or a bike. There's also shuttles to come in from the Galleria. B-Cycle is making rides on his bikes free this week, which is a really great option. Any other way you can get here besides trying to drive your car and park it is gonna be a lot better. This is Midtown. Midtown is next to downtown. It's pretty quiet right now, but there's gonna be a lot of parties and all kinds of events happening here this week and during Super Bowl weekend. This is Bagby Park, which is relatively new. It's right next to downtown, and they're having a block party here next weekend. And this is Midtown Park. ESPN was originally gonna broadcast from this park, but last week they announced they were moving their operation closer to downtown probably because Midtown Park looks like this a week out from the Super Bowl. Uh, a year ago, this whole Super Block was an empty lot, so they've definitely made a lot of progress, but it's not quite TV ready. Mm -hmm. You're gonna throw the ball, then you gotta do a touchdown dance, all right? Finds his man, he's got it! Oh, oh, oh! 